one question I would love to ask yeah. you, Mike, and you're probably a handful of people I can actually ask this question to. So we all know about the Montreal screw job and Brett leaving. So right. you was obviously part of the company during that time, but you were also part of the company when Brett returned. Right. What was right. that like? When did you first hear the rumors that Brett is coming back? And could you believe it after what happened in Montreal? You know, um, not really, but like every time you didn't want to, every time you said, oh, that's not going to happen. No, this shit happened. I mean, it's just, this guy's never coming back. He comes back. It's just, I think it's all about business with Vince. It's just, you know, whether this guy can make me money. I don't care what it costs him to get back. If he got burned before, I'll pay him this much and we'll get his ass back. I want to make some money, you know, or it's really about all about the money. Um, yeah, I felt bad the way Brett went out because he, you know, he kind of went to WCW and really didn't do anything down there, you know, right. and it was kind of like he, you know, it's kind of like, fuck, you know, they hate to see Brett at that time. I think he gave a good 14, 15 career years of uh, WWF at that time, you know, he gave it, he was given, you know, 14, 15 solid years of hard work. And, um, you know, yeah, that, that happened. I was, I was supposed to run out on that match and Owen was right behind me, you know? Right. So wow. yeah. Like, yeah. And all I see is Earl running down the freaking, I'm going, what the fuck did the Belgian <laughs> the fucking spot? I'm like, so I was supposed to, he's supposed to get put, he takes the bump. I'm supposed to slide in count one, two. Then Owen was right behind me. He slides in, grabs me by the loop back of my belt pants or whatever throws me out through the second third rope he shits cans me as he shits cans me he turns around Shawn michael was supposed to super kick him that's the spots that i got <laughs> and owen, owen had that spot too i believe so you know um because owen was supposed to be right behind me on the running because i was supposed to run in owen here it is they ain't screwing my brother you know and then right. shit can me through the second and third rope and then and to take Owen out of the picture was a super kick, I believe, to Owen, you know, and, and I tell that same story. That's what that's what's supposed so, to go down. And we had a fucking bell, and I'm like, look through this curtain, and I'm looking at Briscoe and up. I'm like, what the fuck? But I seen Briscoe and Earl talking off to the side earlier, and I'm going, Man, I wonder if I should go over there. I'm like, I wonder if my shit changed, you know. I'm like, no, my I never did though, you know. Just kept to myself and just had to do what I had to do, but it never got to that point. So Right. Yeah. So yeah, what was Tony the Kimmel, like Tony Kimmel came up to me and said, what the fuck is going on? And he goes, I said, what? He goes, Earl just told me to give these keys to David and make sure David gets them right now. He goes, and don't fuck around, Chimmel. I need those keys to David. He looks stressed. And I'm like, oh, well, I don't know. Maybe they want to get out of here early. <laughs> like they always do. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't think Dan, boy. I, think, I think Jim Cornette beat them out of the arena because Jim Cornette was parked in front of them. <laughs> Yeah, that's ah! right. yeah. yeah, yeah. Jim Cornell was parked right in front of him. They couldn't get out. They had to wait. And he came down. They were like, "Get up, get in your car. Let's go." Oh. So, yeah. And how so, how yeah. was it when you uh, saw Brett years later when he returns? Ah, uh, man, it, it was cool. Me and Brett were cool. I mean, Brett asked me, "Did they?" You know, he asked me earlier in that day because me and Joey staying with Brett. We used to go to some places. Brett was very good friends with Joey. Yes. And um, and I became good friends with Brett. And, you know, Brett asked me during that day, you know, in Montreal, he asked me early in the day, did anybody talk to you? Anybody come up and talk to you and anything? And I said, no, I said, nobody said nothing to me. You know, Brett, I, said, I swear, you know, and then I go, I swear on my mother, you know, I was like, you know, because me and Joey used to always play that, like swearing your mother stuff, you know, and, and Brett used to go, why the fuck do you say that? You know, like, well, we're Catholic, you know, if we see swearing our mother, we that means we're telling the truth. We don't want to lie swearing on our mother. You know, yeah. so yeah. I'm like, and I was, I was shooting with him, you know, it's like serious to get out. Cause he was serious and uh, he goes, okay, coyote. He was like, I appreciate it, man. And I was like, all right, Brett, I, you know, I'll see you later. You know, like, and then he had this shit went down and he just snapped at the end, you know, kicking the doors and, you know, stuff like that. He was pissed. Well, I, I felt bad, man. At that, you know, it was just the way they went to that, the turn thing. It was like, Sean was the, the money of the business at that time. And they seen money in Sean. And I just didn't know why there wasn't enough room for both of them. You know what I'm saying? Like to make that money, you know, right. it was almost like, you know, given Sean, Sean, you know, that you know, everything at that push and he was going to get that push at that time and forget Brett, you know, but yeah, it, it sucked, you know. Pro Wrestling Noah, July 16, Nippon Budokan. 
来年の春までには引退しますケジムトウズ chosen venue the Nippon Budokan the first fight of his retirement streak The challenger, Supernova Kaito Kiyomiya. Don't miss Keiji Mato's retirement run. Noa, Shinihon Pro Wrestler, Amakudai Sakija, Yendaya. Keno challenges New Japan Pro Wrestling Satoshi Kojima for Noa Gold, the GHC Heavyweight Championship. And Ninja Mac is back! On top of that, Rob Van Dam in a hardcore rules match! International stream on Wrestle Universe!